everyone. Good day. It's another day at Walker Bee Ranch. Um, you see, it's a little bit warmer today. The bees are out and uh, flying. So what I was going to try to do is finish fixing this rack over here. Uh, now that they're flying, I'm going to kind of want to land on me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to get suited up. I'm going to try to uh, break these hides and move them over, uh, fix the rack, and then move them right back to where they were. So. Um, hopefully uh, you'll enjoy this. Hopefully I don't get stung too much and uh, we'll see how it goes. Thanks. Yeah, that's probably better. So the idea is to move these highs back here. Move all this stuff over. Um, fix the blocks. Set the other two posts over <laughs> on here and uh, do it at one time. But um, the bees are out and flying today. So it's warm. I didn't warm enough to where I didn't want to um, to bother them. Yep, they're up in the top here. Some of them. This top box here is just a uh, just a, a shim that I've been using for feed. So I can set that off out of the side. And already I'm starting to get some some bumps here. I haven't been in this hive in a, in a while. So. Yep, they're not happy. So I'm wondering if I can just get off this bottom part, or maybe it's light enough now to where I can slide it. No, it's still quite heavy. Mm, this is a heavy, heavy hive, y'all. Real heavy. <clears throat> Tearing me up now on the leg. That's the first one, but there's still it's probably not the best time to do this. But if you look over there, the stand is leaning, so I have to fix it. And today's as good a day as any, I guess. side of my leg. Uh, crap, this is probably take longer than I want to. Mm 
lizards inside this hive. goes as smooth as I planned. So far, no good. Who knows, maybe I don't even have to do this. Very healthy hive. We're just gonna take take one for the team here. Ow. They are trying to tear me up. So no, they didn't like it at all. I'm trying to understand. Yes, I took a bunch, a bunch of stings. 
doing this today. Still taking things. Now the question is, do I just leave them there and let them find their hives? I think that's what I'm going to do with that one. So, he really uh, went after me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave them bees right there. And I'm just going to move everybody else up now. Woo. I watched JC's bees this morning and I saw a video he had where he kind of had a don't move them more than three feet roll so I didn't but they're still very much after me right now Somehow I got stung on the ear through my veil. Even. I'll move that one right there. pretty hopped up right now. Cool. These some of these hives are absolutely gonna explode. This one's got an old inner cover on it. They're really uh, doing it up here. Yeah, they don't like that. Not at all. So this should be well propolized. Well, should have been. They've uh, torn the, the syrup or the uh, <laughs> so now 
We got bees everywhere. Trying to come home. That's good, all that's good. Remove some of this obstruction from in front of them. Just get it out of the way. Hopefully. That. Let them find their home easy. Get a little girl with pollen. I don't know why every time I do a YouTube video my dogs go crazy, but there they are. Alright, so, alright, so it looks like they're finding their way back home, back in. I need to put the feeder back in. Um, because it's kind of warm today. I got stung on my ear. I was going to switch the bottom board, but I ended up not, not doing it. And, uh, let's see if I can... Clean this feeder out a little bit. There's a lot of debris in there. I think they think they're moving it out, but they don't. And there's really nothing left in this feeder right there, so. Now. All right. So, as usual, there's bees everywhere. Um, they don't like the camera too much, but um, I've... Uh, I've moved it down. Now I can start cleaning up some of this stuff, mowing in between where they used to be, and uh, trying to get that done, get the frames. I, uh, yesterday I went and picked up a bunch of stuff yesterday. Uh, I got 10, uh, 10 frame bottoms, 10, 10 frame migratory covers, 250 frames. Um, because you remember I got my nukes, I got to fill them up as well. And I've got, I've got frames, some frames, so everything's looking good right now. Um, I didn't really want to do this, but it's kind of warm out today. So I figured since it was warm, I would go ahead and uh, get into the hives real quick so I could finish my cleanup and move, you know, movement of the hives and whatnot and uh, seems to have cooled down a little bit. And, uh, and we'll see, we'll see. I might have to move this blue one back a little bit more, but that doesn't really, really matter too much. The main thing was I wanted to get all these frames up and uh, get these hives move, these hive stands moved where they were lower to the ground. Um, I might actually have to raise the back of that hive up a little bit. Um, just because I don't want water running down into it. But everything is uh, cooling down. Hope everyone has safe travels to the Hive, uh, Hive Life Conference and uh, maybe I'll see you guys there next year. Anyway, thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video. Thanks.